Mark Andreessen, uh, who has had a, a, an all-out fistfight against Carl Icahn, Scott, has finally decided to resign from the eBay board. Uh, what do you make of that? I think it's the right move. I think he's basically declared victory and is leaving. And he's been on the board six years. He's an incredibly successful venture capital for uh, venture capitalist. Andreessen Horowitz is often ranked number one by anybody who they're in kind of they're they are now a tier one venture capitalist they have an incredibly successful and a public dispute with carl icon is just a distraction for shareholders it doesn't serve anybody any good so this is a this is a this was a good thing for shareholders a good thing for mark it's time for him to move on and i wouldn't been i wouldn't be surprised if we find out several years from now that this is part of the deal with icon for him to for him to calm down. Oh, really? Okay, so maybe, not, uh, uh, although appearing as if this was Mark Andreessen's uh, doing this on his own terms, right, Paul? It, it is, but I think, you know, this is probably just a reflection of this is a major restructuring, uh, obviously, for a, uh, eBay. Uh, and as I said back back in the day when this was announced, it's a, it's a great transaction for PayPal and that it allows PayPal to really go out and attract and, you know, try to find new business, new business partners, new platforms. For the existing eBay business, which really was intertwined very closely with, with PayPal, it's a little bit less clear at this stage, you know, how the, the eBay uh, merchants platform does benefit. But clearly, this is a transaction that probably had to happen for the entire company and for shareholders. They're probably going to be better off longer term. All right, Paul, great to see you. Thank you so much, Paul Sweeney of Bloomberg Intelligence. And thank you as well to Scott Galloway of NYU.